Well, I've got a lot of mileage on my Tesla. What do I have? Something like 80,000 miles. What is the battery degradation like now? Well, I didn't intend to, but anybody who's charged their battery all the way up to the top knows that when it's doing this with this calculating thing, that means you know, it's less than five minutes to go. It's trying to figure out how much capacity is left. It's all software driven. As you can see, we're all the way to the top. So I didn't intend to, but as you can see, this is my new capacity, 242 miles. I started out on this Model X 90D with 259 miles of capacity. So that means that over 80,000 miles, I've lost 6.6% of battery capacity. Well, maybe, maybe it's a little bit higher than that. Maybe it's less than 6.6%. See, it just oh, it flipped again. Oh, now it's 243, gotta recalculate. Well, if it stays at 243, that means it's at 6.2% reduction in capacity since new. How do you think that is? Let me know in the comments. As you probably know, if you've done some uh, research, you drop off fairly quickly in the very beginning, early on, and I did a previous capacity test about a year ago. I can't remember what it was. Go search my channel up on in terms of, of what that is. Let me know in the comments if you think this is uh, acceptable or not. I think it's just fine. I think as long as it stays at this until the battery dies, we're good. And like I said, I didn't intentionally do this. I don't want to intentionally do these, uh, these capacity drops drop-offs because you're never supposed to really charge the battery to 100%. So in summary, I think 6.2% battery degradation is just good for 80,000 miles. If you've had similar or more mileage on your Tesla, let me know the degradation in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching and like and subscribe.